Good morning guys, hopefully you're having a wonderful day. It is Monday morning and it is time to get the week started. Christina and Ellis have taken off, but as you might guess, that leaves me with Duncan for the day. Since it is Monday morning, we're gonna be going into my office for a little while. We're gonna have a little bit of breakfast. We're gonna head out the door. I think we may actually end up stopping by Sam's and the outlet mall on the way back home. I don't know what else is gonna happen today. I suppose we will just find out over time. In addition to doing day job stuff, I'm going to continue to attempt to attack the pile. I actually already did a little bit this morning before Duncan was woken up. I took a little bit of time and looked at this SoundBot power case for the iPhone SE. And like I said, there's a bunch of other things that I need to take a look at. So maybe when we get back, once I've done some more day job stuff, I'll take some time and thoroughly attack the pile. Like I said, I've also got several videos in the works that I need to finish up, so we've got a full busy day in terms of video making ahead as well. But let's have some breakfast and get out the door. Well, after a fairly eventful morning where Duncan was a pretty decent little guy in my office, we went shopping, we picked up some stuff at Sam's, and uh, now we've come to the outlet mall. Because Duncan was good, so we're going to get him some Chinese food for lunch. <laughs> good stuff. That's a big bite. There you go. Well, Duncan and I have made it back home, and DHL just arrived with a couple of packages. Gotta say, I'm not exactly sure what to expect. I know one of them, I'm fairly certain it's this one, has a phone and a lamp, maybe? The other one, I, I really don't know. Maybe it's another phone. We will see. You are not on there correctly. That's better. I kind of love that this thing has a, a little level on the bottom. Anyway, first DHL package. Oh, and you gotta love that. All of the packages I get from China are thoroughly bubble wrapped inside of the package. And usually there's another box inside of the package that has bubble wrap in. I spend lots of time unwrapping these. We're gonna have a major fail here in a second. Yes, as expected. All right, so Elfie Smart Light. Not sure anything about this other than the fact that it's a little squishy light that is supposedly smart in some way. Has an app associated with it maybe. And then the one I was actually really excited about upside down, that's okay. The Talkaze T1S, company that sent out the email about this, sent it out to a boatload of tech reviewers and I was one of the ones that replied to it. I don't know if anybody else did. This is a cell phone, if you can see that. It's probably throwing everything out of focus. This, this little thing that looks like a calculator, it's cell phone. That's gonna make a fun video. I may actually push other things out of the way in order to do that one first. And then this other package is a bag with a box. I don't know what to expect on this one. I do not know. I see a couple of wireless charging receiver modules. If I had to guess, one is probably iPhone and one is probably micro USB. This thing is a mess. There's no box or anything. It's just a brown cardboard box. I don't know. Ah, okay. This is unexpected, but expected. Dear Jordan, thank you for your interest in put to go In order to let you test it, uh, we've sent you a handmade pre-production sample. It may not be perfect, but it should work well enough for you to try it. Understand that the final units will be more finished. Actually, the look of this part of it looks pretty good. It's got a little micro USB plug on here. It's got the little clamp. And basically what you do is you open this up just a little bit and you clip it into your car into one of the air vents and then you just slap your phone onto it. And hopefully my phone will magnetize to it. Oh, it does. Yay, kind of. The Galaxy S7 does have metal or magnets or something inside of it, so it'll work, but I think if I hit a bump, it may not, yeah, it's not gonna stay on there terribly well. Although the car, hopefully, is not gonna be doing this. Yeah, it's gonna slide off over time, which is presumably why they send along magnetic wireless charging modules. This one says it's lightning for, for Apple, and the other one, I would assume, again, is probably micro USB, but it does not say. So that's gonna be a fun video to make. Hopefully it's not destroying my phone. Maybe I'll end up testing it out on the iPhone SE. So yeah, if you're interested in learning more about the put to go, I'll definitely put a link down in the description. They've got a Kickstarter project going on right now. There will be a full video about this, doing tests and everything over on my channel sometime soon. Everything's buzzing, time to get back at it. Boys sitting here in the floor playing together. Ellis has been sitting here babbling. Can you start yelling at him again? Yell at him, Ellis. Tell him all about it. When we walked into daycare to pick him up, he started doing that. He started going, da, 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 da. The teachers had never heard him say it. Apparently it just took daddy coming in. 
Not sure if it was because of me or because of Duncan. Because he started doing it when Duncan walked in. Dad, Dad. I want to chill with him, boss. Dad, Dad. He loves this little ball Christina's parents got him. Because he can grab hold of it, but he doesn't have any teeth, so he's not, you know, biting it or anything. Say, Dad, 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 Dad. Get him, Ellis. You tell him about it. We're also watching Roman destroy his cop car. If you haven't seen that vlog, make sure to check it out. Don't eat the foot. Don't eat Duncan's foot. He needs that for walking and running and skateboarding and kicking things. Don't kick Ellis. Tell him to get the other foot. Got the foot. Tickle him. You can tickle his foot. He's got toes, doesn't he? He's got toes like you do. Is that the funniest thing? Duncan's got toes just like you do. Yell at him, Alice. Yeah. Yell at him. Tell him all about it. Yeah. <laughs> it's super funny. There you go. There you go. There you go. Mommy has made it home, yeah, and there are tacos to be tacoed. Yeah. And Mommy's in workout clothes because she's been working out, getting all buff and stuff, stuff. and stuff. So is it terrible? No, it's actually good. I liked it better. It's better than getting up at four o'clock in the morning. Yes. Yeah. So four o'clock in the afternoon is a good time. Yeah. Except that I ended up with me and all the little ones for a little while by ourselves. So uh, look at that. That's an interesting one. There you go. There he is. Yeah, I came out to go over to the skate park and uh, there were like 15 or 20 kids over there and I'm like not having that right now. But but look at this guy up in the tree. He was just right there. Well, it's only 9.30 and he's already in bed. That one's not. But Duncan is. Duncan's in bed. She's watching the Olympics. I'm watching the Olympics because swimming. Because swimming. This is going to be what you see for, I'm going to be doing for two weeks. And I really don't think there's going to be anything else going on tonight. I allowed myself to get into a little bit of a funk earlier. Just lots of things sort of adding up and I, I just, I'm tired. So I'm going to wrap this up and I'm going to go to bed shortly probably. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you had a wonderful day. We'll see you tomorrow.